Welcome to our tutorial on how to create backup of AOL mail in other formats, such as PDF, PST, MSG, EML, Office 365, Gmail, Thunderbird, Outlook, and more. First, you'll need to generate an app password via your AOL mail account. Head over to mail.aol.com and log in to your AOL mail account. After login, go to the top right corner, and you'll find your username and profile picture. Move the cursor on it and select Account Info. From there, choose Security at the top. Scroll down. You'll come across the option Other Ways to Sign In and App Password. Click on Generate and Manage App Passwords. Enter a name for your app password. Let's call it AOL Backup. Once you've named it, click on Generate Password to create your app password. Remember, this is a one-time password, so ensure to save it in your notepad as it cannot be changed later. Copy your app password. Now go to the Windows Explorer and create a notepad file in your preferred folder. Name the file as you like and paste the app password into it. Now download and install the BitRecover AOL Mail Backup Wizard software on your system. You can find the download link in the description. After installation, launch the software. This is the interface of the BitRecover AOL Mail Backup Wizard software. In the navigation panel, the first step is select mail source. Here, you'll input your AOL mail credentials. Enter your AOL mail address in the designated field for email address. Next, enter the app password that was just generated. The Use Batch Mode option allows users to select multiple accounts for creating their backup. With the Use Proxy option, users can log into their account by providing their IP address. Now, proceed by clicking on the Login button. Upon logging in, you'll arrive at the Backup Panel page. On the left side, you'll find a list of email folders. Here, you can either select folders individually or opt to select all folders by clicking on the top checkbox. On the right side, the first option is Select Saving option. Here, users have the flexibility to select from a range of formats for creating backups, including PDF, PST, MSG, email, Office 365, Gmail, Thunderbird, Outlook, and additional options. Let's choose PDF. Users can select their preferred format as needed. The second option is the file naming option. This feature allows users to select different file naming options. It's particularly useful for creating an organized archive list with customized file names. For instance, if you prefer extracting data based on dates, you can choose the date format naming option. This will export files and name them according to specified dates, like 2018.pdf. 2019.pdf, 2020.pdf, and so forth. Users can select from various filtering naming options according to their needs. For now, let's stick with the default option, subject plus date. The third option is the destination path setting, where users can select the destination path. Simply click on Change, select your desired folder, and click OK. Let's also explore the filter option. Click on the filter option located in the navigation panel. Click on the checkbox to reveal the filter options. The first filter is the date range filter, allowing users to specify a date range to filter emails within selected years. In the from filter, users can input the receiver's name to back up only those emails that received from that particular recipient. Alternatively, using the to filter, Users can input the sender's name to exclusively backup only emails sent to that specific sender. 
The subject filter allows users to input specific subject details to exclusively back up only those emails that contain the particular subject. The fifth option is exclude folders, where users can specify folder names to exclude it from the process. For example, typing sent and inbox will exclude these folders from the process. In the has the words filter, users can input any word, such as an email address. This will result in exporting only those emails containing that specific word. Additionally, there's a request for more features option where users can submit requests for additional feature installations or even suggest customized software. Next is the use the selective export setting for email folder option. The first filter, only export send folder will back up only the send folder and exclude other folders from the process. The second filter, exclude exporting email body content and attachments, will back up only email headers such as subject, date, from, sender, etc. Let's deselect this filter option and return to the backup window panel. With all settings configured, it's time to initiate the conversion process. Simply click on the Backup button, and the BitRecover AOL Mail Backup Wizard software will proceed to backup your files to your preferred format. Once the conversion is complete, you'll receive a notification box indicating the process was successful. Click on OK. In the trial version, you can export only 25 emails. To increase the limit, you have to purchase the license. By clicking OK, we'll redirect to the exported destination path. These are the backup folders. Open the folder and check your backup files. Let's open one PDF file to check. And there you have it. That's how to back up AOL mail to various formats. Thanks for watching. If you found this tutorial helpful, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more helpful tips and tutorials. For more details, check the description.